we are asking for the public's help in locating people who are wanted on outstanding arrest warrants. Join us each week here on We Are Warrants! Hi, I'm Captain Bill Bongo, and I'm here again uh, this week with this week's episode of Willow Warrants. And today I have with me Sharon Hansen, our Hi. animal control officer. Can you tell us a little bit about uh, some things that you think are important for people to know about the animal world? Well, Bill, in regards to uh, dogs and cats, they all need to be licensed, even cats. Uh, cats are not supposed to be outside running around loose. They are supposed to be kept inside or confined, such as on a leash or a fenced-in yard. And now that it's spring, the big issue with people is the yard cleanup, and it's going on all over the city. Please make sure you get out when you can and start cleaning up the yard, because I guarantee the phone calls are going to start coming in of backyards. Well, it could get a little stinky out there. It so definitely could be yeah. stinky and full of poo. So it's that time of year. This is true. All right, so it's real important for people to get their uh, pet registered. How do they do that? Um, all of the vets in the city carry the city license tag. Okay. If you get your shots done at your veterinarian and you purchase your license there, it's $5 for animal that's altered, 25 for an unaltered animal. And we require you know, people to have it done every year. Also make sure you spay and neuter your animal. Not only is it cheaper on your license, but it increases the life of your pet. Oh, okay, so they live a little bit longer if they've been Correct. spayed or neutered. That's what they do. All right, well that's good to know. Yeah, the, another good reason to license your pet is if your pet somehow gets lost, Correct. is wandering around, Ooh. we've got a way Absolutely, get... we've got records. Um, as long as all the license uh, information comes back, we get it put in our uh, Excel program and we can get pets back with their owners. All right, so if we happen to find the pet and it does have a license, then we can get the pet back to the owner. Correct. Well, we've got the wheel here uh, with us today, so I'd like you to give that a good healthy spin. Why not? Yep. That was healthy. Oh yeah. Get some power in that one. Should be catching dogs. That's true. All right. Let's see who this week's uh, winner is. All right, this week's uh, contestant on the Wheel of Warrants is Mr. John Joseph Waters. Sometimes you just gotta jump off the cliff. Yeah. <laughs>